please like my videos please subscribe to my channel and please press the bell icon so that you get to know when my latest video has come and to learn more and to find a video relevant to you please do check out my videos list hello namaskar and adab to all my friends from your friend astrologer and guide irfan once more with you from your video on channel astro assurance of the various planets that seem to be trouble making planets in the horoscope one of such planets is a debilitated planet and a lot has been said in the ancient texts in various shlokas whether it is in the brihat parashara hora shastra or the hora ratnam or the jataka chandrika brihat samhita whichever astrological text you pick up you will find that not great results have been predicted for a debilitated planet so out of the trouble making planets debilitated planet is one of them however sometimes a debilitated planet may not give us results that are expected or as defined by the various lokas or various astrological texts why is it that a debilitated planet may not throw up huge troubles as sometimes as are put in the various lokas or it may give very different or very unusual results from what we expect from a debilitated planet so let's deep dive into what a debilitated planet can give us results as from a unusual manifestation point of view i have already done videos on how debilitated planets will behave and what you can expect from different debil debilitated planets today i am talking about how a debilitated planet will give you unusual results and how to an extent you can overcome the debilitation of a planet by virtue of how you carry yourself your mannerism and your way of life your approach rather than depending only on a yoga or a cancellation and so on so firstly a debilitated planet we know that if its debilitation is cancel then obviously it will not throw up as challenging results as normally a debilitated planet is expected to give you results so if there is a debilitated mars and what kind of results a debilitated mars may generally give or is defined as given when a nuch bond happens when a debilitation cancellation of mars happens then mars may not give you as challenging results as upheaval bringing results or as you know downfall bringing results as is normally expected from a debilitated mars so what usually you mean by debilitation cancellation is where wherever planet is debilitated and sitting in the sign the ruler of the sign or a planet which gets exalted in the sign is aspecting that particular planet or is in conjunction with it say for example if mars is in the cancer sign where it gets debilitated if either moon or jupiter moon rules cancer and jupiter gets exalted in the sign of cancer if either of them are either aspecting mars in the cancer sign or placed in conjunction in that house in that sign then debilitation cancellation of mars happens and then less challenging results are brought upon us however complete cancellation definitely doesn't happen debilitation is is like you have a very uh, clean neat piece of paper very smooth just come out of the by from the stationery now if you crumple up that piece of paper and then you uncrumple it and then you smooth in it out and even iron it it will still not get become as smooth as before the lines of where it got crumpled and the wrinkles will still be seen and you cannot move away from it similar is a debilitation cancellation it is like a crumpled piece of paper is uncrumpled but the lines will remain so the challenging results the upheaval bringing results will still be there but not to the extent as before however a debilitated planet may give very very different results from just a debilitation cancellation if it's a double debilitation cancellation what do we mean by double debilitation cancellation where both the planet which rules that sign as well as the planet which gets exalted in that sign both are aspecting that planet or both are conjunct with the planet it is mars gets uh, gets debilitated in cancer both moon and jupiter are placed along with mars in the sign of cancer or both are aspecting mars then the debilitation cancellation is a double debilitation cancellation i will make a separate video on what it means in detail on the manifestation of a double debilitation Uh, debilitated planet cancellation however just remember so far 
for this particular video that double deputation cancellation to large extent will remove the challenging aspects of the debilitated planet however unusual and suddenly either good results may also come from the planet but it could also mean that you, you face some downfall some challenge but by virtue of your strong willpower which mars represents you may be able to come out of that even the little bit of challenges that the debilitated planet may give in its dasha nantar dasha even that can be overcome by virtue of how you carry yourself using and enhancing the energy of mars so that is one thing whenever you have a debilitated planet and if it's in, in a challenging phase even if it's a debilitation cancellation then there are ways and means through your your through your characteristics through your approach through your mannerism through your attitude when you can overcome the debilitation cancellation as well or debilitation also now the other reason why a debilitated planet may give you unusual results is where there are malefics involved so if a planet is debilitated let's stick with mars for this video if a planet is debilitated such as mars and now you have two other malefics either conjunct with the planet or aspecting the planet for example both sun and saturn or both saturn and rahu both are conjunct with mars or both are aspecting mars then the challenge can be much much high then the debilitated planet will give you unusual results and unusual in a negative way rather than in a positive way but if there are two benefits which are aspecting the debilitated planet for example mars is getting debilitated in cancer and both mercury and venus or venus and moon or venus and jupiter all of these are um, benefit planets any two are aspecting mars or all three aspecting mars or any three aspecting mars then the debilitation will to large extent be smoothed out and in fact the debilitated planet in dasha nantar dasha will give you unusual results which means it may give you slightly challenging results but it will give you one good opportunity of a sudden Uh, opportunity a big opportunity which it will be the opportunity will be given to you but results will not be guaranteed unless you act on the opportunity so when a planet gets debilitated you need to understand the nature of the planet and act to enhance its strength utilizing the benefit and attachments to it or aspects on it or conjunctions to it so here because mars is ha- mars has two or three benefic aspects on it or say conjunctions then the person needs to work with lot of will power lot of motivation lot of purpose then the positive results may also come out of the debilitated planet though some debilitation will still results will still be coming out of it because here we are talking about two or three benefic aspects on it but not a debilitation cancellation if a planet is in a debilitation cancellation plus it has benefic aspects on it still some challenges of the debilitation will be will be there however a large opportunity will come to the person from time to time nothing will be improved automatically but opportunities to be able to get good results out of the dasha nantar dasha of a debilitated planet will keep being giving to the native so the person will keep getting opportunities to get more gains to be able to achieve what the uh, what uh, what desires he has what goals he has but he have to work hard and you have to work with a lot of will power and a lot of motivation and a sense of purpose which mars represents if the person is able to do that then the person is following the characteristics of the planet the attitude and the nature of the planet and thus you enhance the nature of the planet and the strength of the planet and then the debilitation to large extent will not um, give you challenges and in fact you will be able to get good results out of the planet the other reason why a planet may give you unusual results or um, in it in, when it's debilitated could also mean because the debilitated planet is in a challenging placement in a certain nakshatra but the person is not doing anything about it for example jupiter gets cancelled at fifth degree in the sign of capricorn in the nakshatra of uttarashada which is ruled by the sun so if you do nothing about the debilitation and you live the life by default then the challenging results come upon you however if you want to lessen the debilitation impact when there are no benefic aspects on it there is no any help from the zodiac 
then one way to overcome the debilitation is by by being true to the nature of jupiter jupiter is wisdom jupiter is learning so add learning to yourself learn from the high experiences so when life throws challenges at you debilitated jupiter throws challenges at you throw up he goes through situations which will put you in challenges learn from those experiences get a high learning from those experiences so if you face a challenge from from a friend don't the learning is not that all friends are bad or friendship is bad the higher learning is that you need to learn to trust people with more discretion don't jump headlong into trusting friends and the high learning also is that if one friend cannot be trusted there are many more friends who you can depend on so you don't need to depend on only one person you need to expand your circle of friendship because jupiter is a planet of expansion so what is the nature of jupiter expansion and if your friend is not giving you sound advice or giving you wrong advice because of which there is a downfall which means you need to expand your circle of friends whom you need to depend on who you need to get wise counsel from and learn from those downfall that you have and so even a debilitated planet can give you experiences however what it also means is that because jupiter is in the sign of capricorn which means that one on one side you need to enhance the nature of the planet of jupiter enhance its strength by living its positive values second because it is in capricorn which means it is the planet of discipline or planet is in the sign of discipline which capricorn represents hard work commitment perseverance and patience so persevere keep working hard be patient work with discipline work in a structured manner then you will find that you will add strength to the sign also in which jupiter is present because sign is playing a huge part in giving the planet its debilitation and the last is in which nakshatra does jupiter or the debilitated planet get debilitated in here the debilitated jupiter gets debilitated in the nakshatra of uttarashada ruled by sun which means you need to also enhance the strength of the manifestation or the characteristic of the sun because it is sun's nakshatra in which jupiter is getting debilitated which means you need to act with more responsibility you need to take more accountability you need to be the leader to help others in giving wise counsel in helping in expanding your circle of influence but also to help others so the circle of influence that you have expand that circle of influence expand your learning expand your high learning learn from your high experiences or the downfalls in life and act with discipline act with lot of structure and with a leadership of that sun represents and accountability that sun represents and the leadership is not for self but to help others if you do that then you are adding to the strength of the debilitated planet which has lost all its strength and you will add more and more positive layers on the strength of the planet so your your jupiter's debilitation to large extent will not only be overcome but you may also add positivity to the planet and you will find that if you do that you act giving the positive dimension of the debilitated planet and a positive dimension of the sign that it is placed in and a positive dimension of the nakshatra lord where it gets debilitated in then you find that the debilitation can also to be can be overcome to large extent and at least some good or a lot of good can be manifested also out of even a debilitated planet so if you have a debilitated planet don't lose hope don't think all is lost don't be wary of or fearful of the dasha and antar dasha of a debilitated planet or if debilitation is by saturn don't fear sade sati live out these characteristic these manifestation and you'll find that you'll be safer even during the dasha antar dasha transit of the debilitated planet so whenever planet in any negative instance gives you challenges find a way to be able to overcome that through a more positive manifestation positive approach positive attitude being patient be, and being and persevering and you'll find that things turn out to be much for the better so friends like this video share this video and if you're looking for a personal consultation for me please reach out to me at the links given below until some other time some other video this is a friend astrologer and guided from signing off